Now from News 10 NBC, coverage you can count on. This is News 10 NBC at 11. We will be the recipients of a four and a half million dollar gift. A big donation tonight from two of the great Rochester families. The money will go towards building a new hockey arena at RIT. The money comes from the Gene Policini Foundation and the Tom Golisano Partnership. Good evening, I'm Leah Lando. And I'm Rich Funky. Those two men started paychecks together and they have donated tens of millions of dollars back to the community. Gene Policini passed away 10 years ago shortly after starting the foundation now run by his wife, Wanda. He was a huge hockey fan. And with tonight's donation, the new arena at RIT will be named after him. This is a, de a design of what it could look like. New at 11 tonight, Berkeley Breen was ice level when the crowd got the good news. Berkeley? Hey, Rich uh, Lee, it's gotta be one of the hottest tickets tickets in town. Uh, too hot, in fact. If you're not there at an RIT hockey game early, you're not getting a seat. So when the fans heard about the money and the new arena, no wonder they cheered as if the Tigers had scored. Game night at RIT. That means standing room only. For Patty Snell, it means standing two or three rows back. The camaraderie is great, but it's it's better to sit down. She is not alone. Just look at this crowd. It's like this almost every home game. At least Martha Vicario found a seat. The support of the team that, that's here, it's, it's unbelievable. And they, everybody's standing around. They deserve seats. Now they're closer to getting them. RIT President Bill Dessler went on the ice with some good news. We will be the recipients of a four and a half million dollar gift. It's money to help build a new four to five thousand seat arena. First of all, it'll mean that people can come out from the Rochester region to get into the games. As you know, frequently they'll come out even an hour or two before the games and the games will be sold out. This parking lot on the south side of campus is where they want to build the new arena. The advantage is that the field house is on the other side of campus. So they could have events in both places on the same night and you'd still be able to find a place to park. The money comes from the Gene Policini Foundation and Tom Golisano Partnership. That was Policini Policini's widow Wanda with President Dessler on the ice. The arena will bear Policini's name and it's going to come with a lot more legroom. It would be great to have a bigger place, absolutely. This donation brings up their total to $8 million. They need to raise $15 million in order to start building the $30 million arena. The idea, so they're halfway there, more than halfway. The idea is to start to build this arena next fall, and that means they could drop the puck on the brand new place at the beginning of the 2013 season. All right, Berkeley Breen reporting tonight with some very good news. Thanks, Berkeley.